Hey, 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 this is Kurt the Boat Doctor out here in this beautiful Edge Marine. Look at that green. These, uh, I believe the area had the 20 by 50 by 55 degree hole. <clears throat> See how deep that V is, how broad and how high. This thing cuts through the water. This is one of my favorite boats. Uh, this even got the stainless steel windlass. You don't see many of those on an Edge Marine. Got your uh, pulpit, got your Danford style anchor, uh, two speed winch. They don't rust on you. Uh, you got a step to come down. Your brake fluid's under here. Flat clip on the coupler. Two inch ball, about 20 inches from the bottom to the top. Got your safety pin, flat five on the trailer wire, spare tire and carrier. And those are ST22575 R14s, I believe. 15s, actually. Ah, huh, even more heavy duty. Got siphons on the tire. Good for mud bogging. <clears throat> you got your uh, Fulton Jack, which you can lock this here. So your handle doesn't go you got trailer brakes on that you got the v block so this virtually unless you submerge the trailer with that v block and those double bunks with the decking on them and we flip them upside down so the groove so that gets the water up on there it acts as an air hockey so it just slides right on off and got big straights lifting straights which actually helps lift plus it helps keep this boat in a straight line and low uh low speeds and high winds I got the top, the sides, the backdrop. This is a towable top, two wipers on that. Nice deep sides, custom built trailer, mag wheels, five lug, 80 pound torque, disc on all four. Uh, they did a real nice job, powder coated the uh, melt shook all those lights. He's got some up on top, he's got some on the sides, he's got his rig in the back. And like I say, that is a towable top. And he's got his uh, pole holders there. You could even use that for tuning for hand lines. You got your ladder, uh, no trim tabs. Uh, you got all oh, this we designed to have the high speed pickup right here. That keeps the water back to the top. That's a reverse back there with the delta pad. Then I turn the batteries off. I think I got to take get this wedge out before I put it in the water. All seal lights, LEDs, got the total scan transducer. This is a 200 Suzuki with a 15 by 15. You got a Suzuki lean burn, it says fuel injection. Whoa, whoa, and a 99. That's awesome. Good rigging job. Heavy duty tie bar. Reverse chine hole here. That keeps it nice and flat. Uh, got a little play table there. And then I'll get it on the inside so you can see it. Since there's loading up anyway over there. And what was I gonna do when I got in here? Oh, turn the battery switch so I can get that ram out of there. Got the rear entry door. Got the bed lining all the way around, no carpet on the sides anywhere. So you just hose her off, you're done. You got your ski pylon right there. Your war sound hose there. Got a fish box right here. And you got pole holders right there. You open up here and you can turn your batteries on. And uh, down in there is your drain plug, so always take that out. Don't, do not leave that in the boat for over a week. Try to take it out every time, auto bilge product. <laughs> this here has got that tube down there. That drains your water out of this fish box I'm standing on. So I, you can plug it from the inside or outside. I did it from the outside, but there is a plug. You can wrap a string onto it. You can a good bleeder box for tuna. And then you get down, you can just pull it out with a string and pull that plug out. If you wanted to you got uh, storage seats again and there's a boot no carpet you got the crab dab at pole that goes over there where that play table is put that up here look you got the storage there these are all lockable nice and deep you can put carpet up in there and that even quietens them down more and that looks like a 12 inch Lawrence hds7 got the suzuki gauge bilge pump works nav light courtesy lights are those grab rails and that's integrated i mean this boat is clean i think it only made it like not even an hour once it hit her lot uh large glove box all the manuals are in there grab handles there anyway this top's all welded in tube look how thick those tubes is what that does, you don't even have to have a latch up there because that window's so heavy and at that slant. So what these tubes do actually, they look cool for one thing. 
they stiffen up the sides of the boat is another thing and like I say you take the top down you think this is a tournament boat and then how they arch like that if you took those side curtains off you could fish right there and the driver could too I could just fish right off the side right here it's got imagine this is a DEC and you got to hit that oh I got to turn the batteries on evidently yeah got a half tank of gas wipers work yeah uh, key here this is for your windlass I checked that deck light board auxiliary one and two are for your lights but I'm going to check those real quick and deck lights this is your selector for this your trim here so this is DEC and you got your troll here Suzuki gauge all those work horn works we'll see if those lights light light and rigid light that works and then you got a set up front so I don't know how we got that one lined up uh, I will hit the nav light deck light worse down auxiliary auxiliary uh, so I don't know where we got them front lights hooked to because this is courtesy and I can do that and this is nav and that would be deck lights and that's auxiliary one and two unless it and I'll put them like that to see if they came on yep they did so all the lights work and then I'll go through the rest of this when I'm on the water so we're gonna turn off 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 and turn okay uh, we're gonna go out and show you this bad boy you're gonna love it got a re uh, remote for the kicker too with a tie bar boat doctor you got a winner chicken dinner